Hello everyone, and welcome to my General Hospital News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. According to General Hospital spoilers, Dex Heller and Jocelyn Jack's futures can still be bright. When Jocelyn discovered that Dex had once been open to killing Cyrus Renault, she was taken aback, but a lot has happened since then. Jocelyn undoubtedly agrees of Dex's decision to distance himself from Sonny Corinthos, as it has completely changed his life. In addition, Dex is starting a new career as a recruit for the police school, and with luck will become a real police officer. Jocelyn is relieved that Jason Morgan is keeping an eye on Dex, even as she was first worried about him joining the PCPD. Now that Jocelyn has expressed support for Dex's most recent job move, the old tension is beginning to fade. The only thing preventing Jocelyn and Dex from getting back together is Joss's current intransigence. Given that Dex is aware that everything with Cyrus was an error, does Jocelyn really need to harbor animosity toward him indefinitely? Jocelyn and Dex will play a flirtatious game with each other over the week of May 6-10, according to GH spoilers. There's going to be competition of some kind, so Jocelyn might wind up racing Dex and maybe even placing a wager alongside him. Could there be a spark of romance amongst all the flirtation and rivalry? Under such conditions, it's easy to see Dex and Jocelyn getting back into bed together. Of course, that doesn't imply Jocelyn and Dex will get back together romantically, but at the very least, they may complicate matters by getting back into bed together. In the aftermath, Jocelyn could swear it was a mistake, but if their chemistry is clicking again, she might not be able to resist giving Dex another run at it. Trina Robinson can tell Jocelyn still has feelings for Dex, and she would even consider it a positive sign if they rekindle their passion. Jocelyn might struggle to recommit, though, and she might complicate things by suppressing her emotions. Here are some guesses for what's coming next on General Hospital, as spoilers suggest that Dex and Jocelyn may ultimately make some adjustments to their relationship. According to General Hospital previews, Eva Jerome will make an effort to hold Sonny Corinthos close to her heart, but it won't be easy when he's agitated and under the influence of medication. It appears that Sonny's stay at the penthouse will be erratic after his altercation with Carly Spencer. Sonny may be urged by Ava to simply unwind with a drink and let her in, but it seems like he'll go for a walk to decompress instead. This will cause Sonny to run into Natalia Ramirez at the park, and in the May 6 episode, they will talk more and become closer. If Sonny brings up his conversation with Natalia afterwards, Ava might become irritated. Natalia might be getting in the way of Ava's ambition to be the one person Sonny trusts. Ava will receive some news later on in the week of May 6 to 10, which makes her feel ignored. Sonny intends to go to the wedding of Brooke Lynn Quartermain and Harrison Chase, but it doesn't appear that he will ask Ava to go on a date. Natalia will contemplate how she might be included to the guest list for the wedding in the interim. It's strange that Natalia would want to go at all considering her problems with Brooke Lynn's handling of Blaze, alias Alison Rogers. But Natalia is a troublemaker and a busybody, so she could feel compelled to go hang out with Blaze like the helicopter mother she is. Sonny will finally present Natalia with a suggestion to think over. It seems like Sonny will inquire about Natalia's intention to attend the wedding and recommend that she accompany him as his guest. Ava will undoubtedly be incensed at the thought of having another lady on Sonny's arm. If Ava can't figure out how to stop Ava and Sonny from connecting, she could think Natalia is going to ruin everything. In summary, RGH predictions indicate that Natalia will most likely be Sunny's wedding date, therefore Ava will undoubtedly react negatively and may even conspire to thwart this alternative romance. Stay in as general hospital spoilers hint that Ava may try to use cunning to steal spoilers Natalia away general hospital from hint that since Carly Spencer saved John Jagger Cates from an attack in an alley late at night adjacent to the Corinthos Coffee Warehouse, the two have become closer. After scaring the thugs away, Carly brought John back to his hotel room, where she attended to his wounds and spent the entire night making sure he would be all right. 
John gave Carly his phone number since he was appreciative and they appeared to be joking about a little. Spoilers for General Hospital, John Cates isn't being truthful with Carly Spencer. There's a good probability Carly will accept John's invitation when he finally does. However, John is withholding a huge information concerning Jason Morgan from Carly. More than two years prior, John, working on behalf of the FBI, arrested Jason and threatened to use him as an informant. However, Jason had to pretend to be dead to everyone he cared about. If Jason didn't infiltrate the Pikeman group, John threatened to have Carly imprisoned for Recio crimes, which carries a 20-year jail sentence. G.H. Spoilers Port Charles welcomes back Jason Morgan. Jason left Port Charles after his cover was revealed, but John is still pressuring him to work for him by threatening to put Carly in jail. But by getting so close to Carly, John has gone too far. Carly will undoubtedly find out the truth eventually, even though Jason is unable to tell her anything about John because doing so would be against their agreement. Carly may not know that the man she is threatening is also her romantic partner, but Jason might not be able to stand by and watch. Spoilers for General Hospital. Carly Spencer will want to act. It seems fairly inevitable that Carly's affections for John will vanish the moment she learns the truth. When she truly understands the extent of Jason's sacrifice for her, she will get very distraught. If doing so will liberate Jason, she might approach John and order him to arrest her, considering his attraction to Carly and the fact that she has already saved his life once. Does John truly have what it takes to harm her in that way? How do you feel? Would Carly really be arrested by John? When Carly learns of the extent of Jason's sacrifice, how will she respond? Is there a chance that John and Carly may start dating after the truth is revealed? If doing so will liberate Jason, she might approach John and order him to arrest her, considering his attraction to Carly and the fact that she has already saved his life once. Does John truly have what it takes to harm her in that way? How do you feel? Would Carly really be arrested by John? When Carly learns of the extent of Jason's sacrifice, how will she respond? Is there a chance that John and Carly may start dating after the truth is revealed? More than two years prior, John, working on behalf of the FBI, arrested Jason and threatened to use him as an informant. However, Jason had to pretend to be dead to everyone he cared about. If Jason didn't infiltrate the Pikeman group, John threatened to have Carly imprisoned for Recio crimes, which carries a 20-year jail sentence. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.